In the anime and manga series, Demon Slayer, swordsmiths are skilled craftsmen who create and repair the swords used by demon slayers. The swordsmiths are depicted wearing masks, which serve several purposes. Firstly, the masks are worn to protect the swordsmiths from inhaling harmful substances such as metal dust, which can be produced during the sword making process. Inhaling these particles can be harmful to the lungs, so the masks help to prevent the swordsmiths from breathing them in. Secondly, the masks are a traditional part of the swordsmith's attire and are symbolic of their craft. The masks are often decorated with intricate designs or patterns, which reflect the swordsmith's individual style and personality. Finally, in the context of the series, the masks also serve as a way for the swordsmiths to maintain their anonymity and protect their identity. The swords created by the swordsmiths are highly sought after, and revealing their identity could make them targets for theft or other forms of harm. Overall, the masks worn by the swordsmiths in Demon Slayer serve both practical and symbolic purposes, while also helping to preserve the anonymity of the swordsmiths. Now question for you guys, whose sword was most complicated to make for swordsmiths?